Well, soon we'll start to get a taste of fall-like temperatures, but when's it actually going to look like fall? Yeah, Fox Eyes meteorologist Audrey Puente breaks down the science behind the season. The days are getting shorter and cooler. Along with the change in weather comes the change in color on trees across the Northeast. There are millions of people across the country who are always on the lookout for those fall colors. Evan Fisher is the owner and founder of Explore Fall, a website dedicated to fall foliage. At the moment, we have very favorable conditions, and I'm hopeful that that will hold out all the way into October when those leaves are peaking. Leaves are green in the spring and summer because that is when they are making a lot of chlorophyll. Fill, a green pigment that has the very important job of absorbing light to turn into sugars that the tree uses for its own energy. As we transition to the fall season, we see less and less sunlight due to a lower sun angle. With less sunlight, the leaves produce less sugar and the energy is absorbed by the trunk of the tree for the winter season. The green color eventually fades away and underneath lies bright oranges and yellows and browns and those are the colors we see on the trees for the fall season. So when we come into fall, we're really looking at two things the summer or the summer stress that we're um, unfortunately having to deal with and that does play a role in what happens in October even if it was a hot or dry or wet summer there will still be likely some good color to be found I know it's been a drier summer on average so that will have some impact likely a delay on the fall color but that being said, everything else is generally okay. Evan says the first peaks of color here in the tri-state will likely be in the first five to seven days of October, especially when temperatures start to get around 40 degrees at night. That is fuel for foliage. Just drive around, go up in elevation, go down in elevation, head more towards the coast, head more inland. You'll find it somewhere in there in those first few weeks of October. So make sure you're paying attention to whether or not there's a big rain event or a big wind event right around the corner and get out there before that happens because the worst, worst thing that happens to travelers in the fall is the leaves are perfect and then overnight they all fall off because of a heavy rainstorm. It is such a small oh, window of opportunity to see them. It's so beautiful, them. for sure. Mm -hmm. I look forward to it. It's coming soon.